Here is the best kept secret to answering priority nursing questions. If you are faced with a question that has the keywords best, highest, priority, immediate, initial, first response, then you're probably dealing with a prioritization question. When you're faced with this question, here are a few tips. Number one, focus on the facts. Don't overthink, don't think what if, don't add new information, read what's in front of you. Focus on what's happening right now and what the nurse needs to do in that moment. Let's look at this example and bring it all together. The nurse is caring for a client who is scheduled for surgery in two hours and is reporting anxiety and shortness of breath. The client has a heart rate of 110 beats per minute and respirations of 24. Which of the following actions would be a priority for the nurse to take? Here are our answer options. Number one, administer two milligrams of morphine IV push. Number two, place the client in Fowler or high Fowler position. Number three, request a prescription for a bronchodilator, nebulizer treatment. And number four, reassure the client that it is normal to feel anxious before a surgical procedure. Based on the information in the actual question, we have enough subjective and objective information to know or infer that this client is experiencing shortness of breath, but we don't know from what. Does it matter? Not right no, no, now. No. And that's where questions like this can become tricky because it's easy for us to think, what if he has asthma? What if he's having a panic attack? What so the nursing priority here would be to alleviate shortness of breath and facilitate oxygenation. Thanks for joining me today. It's Professor Jess B. If you found this video helpful, let me know in the comments below and see you back here for the next one.